Hello and welcome back to the craft box today. We are on episode 322, I believe, um, of the death walkthrough. Uh, today we're defeating some stray kittens to start with. 4,140 health. Um, they are fire. We are just killing now. I thought I'd just cut out a little bit of the work that we had to do, aka one round. Um, but yeah, so last time, if you haven't checked it out already, you should go and check it out. Really should. Um, but these guys are now dead. Hopefully we collect some memory cores. Actually, one of them does not die. Unlucky. Unlucky. We we do not collect memory cores because did not die. That's un unfortunate. Here's too much block. I don't know how that's possible because they're fire, but that is fine. We will deal with it. We will deal with it and try again. Okay. Um, this kitten is too good. Too good. I don't like him. I do not like him. He is not good or cool or good. Or, or cool or good. I don't like it. Fire dragon. Ouchie. 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 Um, but yeah, we're in the lovely, the lovely Sky City. And hopefully, maybe, we'll be able to finish this area today, which would be pretty cool. Pretty cool. This is one of the last areas of um, Lemuria. Uh, let's see. Will this kill is a good question. Crit. And let's see. Can it kill? Bum ba dum bum. Kablam. I think it does. I think it does. Very good. Very nice. Very epic. Oh, I don't have dialogue up. That's handy. Pepper interrogation. Full alert in force. Okay. So they've taken Buck to interrogation, and there's a full alert in force. So yeah, we need to go into the guard complex, which is here. Very cool. And we have some fights and stuff. And yeah, we're probably going to finish this area today, and next episode we'll be in the heap. This area is pretty quick. Um, there is a cheating the boss outsider. coming. The outsider! They're here to free the prisoner! Stop them! Stop them! Um, so yeah, these guys, Neighborhood Watch, Death version. We have already defeated some Neighborhood Watches, so I'll be back in a sec. Um, but yeah, they're not too bad. They ain't too bad. Right, I am back. We are just about to kill this last guy. They have 4,450 health, I believe. Um, which is a little bit. A little bit. Um, they do spam weaknesses, um, so just be careful of that. Uh, but yeah, I killed one of them. Not the other. Slightly unfortunate, but hey, that's how the cookie crumbles. Uh, but he should be dead now, hopefully. Fingers crossed. Um, but yeah, just be careful. Weakness spam is a thing, and it is pain, and it is terrible. So, yeah, you know, just death, death things. <laughs> just death things. Uh, right, no dialogue. That's interesting. Would have expected dialogue there, but that's fine. That's fine, I guess. Uh, let's head up. Next floor. Intruder alert. Intruder alert. Okay, watchful eye. These guys are shadow. Um, they probably resist death, I would say. So I'm gonna pack in prisms to be sure. We haven't actually defeated these guys, but again, they are just eyes. They have, um, a little bit of health. 4,450 again. Um, so yeah, I'll be back in just a second. Right, I am back. We have just defeated those eyes. Very cool. Very easy. Not too bad. And we go up. We go up. One more level. Resistance is useless, Gordon. Soon my grand plan will be fulfilled, and all Lemuria will be mine. Oh, that's not good. Never, Morg. I'll stop you. Your will already weakens. Wait, what is this? Ah, your wizard friend has come to save you, as I hoped they would. Once my pets have destroyed you both, there will be nothing standing in the way of my conquest. <laughs> Pathetic wizard. Who can save you now? Oh my. Right, let's do this. Rank 19 Elite Balance Boys, Cyber Beasts. So they're like the dinosaurs that we faced before, except they're robot versions of them, because that's cool. We don't need that. Um, the guys below did resist death, so just so you know, I'm pretty sure. I'm 90% sure of that. Um, well, I'm just going to find out the cheats for the next boss fight, because that would be good to know. Um, but yeah, these guys pretty simple balance not too difficult at all They do have quite a little bit of health. I would say since they're rank 19 elite boys um, But hey, I'm sure it'll be 
Easy clap. Yeah, 5,120. Not too bad. Not too bad. Definitely not the worst. Um, can I kill? We do boost. Do we try? Do we try? Do we dare say try? I do dare say try. We, we try. We try and kill. We'll see if we do well. We may not. We may not succeed. We will just ship a fools in a couple rounds if we do not succeed. But hey, you know, if we don't try, we will never know if we succeed or not. And we did not succeed because we did not crit, um, which is very upsetting. Or at least I don't think we crit. Surely we crit. We must have crit that. We must have crit that. Um, but we did not succeed, but that's fine. Ship of Fools will easily finish them off. Easy finish them off. What the heck thing was that? Weird. Fire and myth. Interesting. Um, we will blade. We will blade into a ship. And GG. Hopefully. Probably. Most likely. Maybe. Definitely. Right? Definitely. Right? Kablam. Blade. Life blade. Fire blade. Really interesting blades they got here. Really interesting blades they got going on here. But that's fine. Not going to question it at all. <clears throat> Not going to question it at all. Because why question things when... That will cause pain and suffering. Uh, right. Here we go. Kablamo. And Ship of Fools should be good. GG. Crit. Blade. Kablam. In a sec. In a sec we do Kablam. Now we do Kablam. And they did. Love to see it. Love to see it. Goodbye, sweet prince. Or sweet dinosaur. I don't know. Boy, am I glad to see you. Mind giving me a hand? I do mind, actually. You shouldn't get yourself into these situations, Buck. Thanks, wizard. How'd you find me? Cat robots? Weird. You've met the resistance? Good. Let's go. Okay. <clears throat> Let us go. By the way, if you go up those steps, I believe the little LED Zeppelin is up there. Which is the Z quest, by the way. So, just a wee little heads up. Um, let's go back to the Resistance HQ, which is down the drain just here. Just need to cross the road safely from these cats. Don't want to be fighting cats again. No, thank you. And we made it down. I do have a mark. I don't have a mark. I originally had a mark down here, but I deleted it because I'm like, we don't need a mark down here anymore. Nope. So that's fun. That's fun. Right, Buck. Hello. Hi. The wizard rescued me, everyone. Now listen up. There's a lot you need to hear. Now we know who our true enemy is, Morg. He calls himself Morg the Merciless. Morg, the chief magical engineer? The same. He built the mind ray and reprogrammed the iRobots. But his real plan is far worse. He explained it in great detail with charts. Morg plans to boost the mind ray using the new mana infusion. He'll increase its range and power a hundredfold. He can enthrall all of Lemuria. If I can manipulate the mana font, I might be able to depower the ray. Oh, but the Mongonian badges aren't ready. How can I get to it? What's that, wizard? You can create magical images of it with photomancy? Amazing! Photomanced images of the font will show if my plan can work. I'll stay here and help prepare for the coming battle. Good luck, wizard. Right. Okay. Let's go do that. We're going to leave a mark down here because we'll be back there in a sec. Um, I am playing smart, not stupid today. I've decided today is the day that I actually play smart. How many spellments do we have, by the way, for this boy? 46. Not too bad. I think we should be able to probably just squeak out one spellament upgrade from this. Uh, the fountain is this one here, I assume. Watch this be the thumbnail of the video. Watch it. No, nah, it'll probably be Morg. Because, um, you know, that's so much better. Right, let's get a nice wee thumbnail photo of the fountain. Oh, wow, look at that. That is... Nope, hold up. There we go. Perfect. They can definitely use I that. I am confused, wizard. We must stop Morg from enthralling Lemuria. But if he did so, Lemuria would become as tranquil as this place. Is that not good? I feel it is not, but I don't understand why. 
Do these people not seem happy? Is their happiness false? I must consider this. Yeah, you must. It is their happiness is false, I would say. Um, and then we go back down, I assume. Yup, sounds like it. Lovely, lovely, lovely. We go down into the lab. Hello, 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 Dr. Vakov. Excellent! Now, let me see what is happening here. This is not good. This is very bad. I can't disrupt the flow. Uh, it's too strong. There's no way to stop the mind ray! Oh, yes, there is. Stop its maker! We need to take Morg down once and for all. Come on, wizard. Let's team up and fight him. Buck! Ha! Oh, you're a miracle! No, I'm just a deer, with a deer's courage. Morg told me where his lair is, but he bragged that nobody can breach the gates. How do we get in? Gaha! The iRobots! Morg reprogrammed them. If you dismantle their databanks, you can find the entry code to unlock the gate! The Mongonium badges are ready. Take one, Buck. The Resistance will go distract the Neighborhood Watch. You attack the eye robots. Let's go! Right, I'll be back once I've got the entry code. Here, I've got it. The code is 12,345. What do you know? That's the same as my Foot Locker. Let's get to it. Right, we know the code now, which is very cool. We will get in. I am going to take out these Death Prisms because I don't think we'll need them. And we will hit in here. Lovely. Sigil. Really fun. Really epic. Really cool. Let's see. What is in here? Some fights, of course. Haha. -ha. Um, yeah. Let's go and take down Morg. Hello, Morg. Here we go, wizard. Let's trounce these overblown lizards. Right, more lizards. We've got uh the, the uh, ice and storm, both rank nineteen elite. Ice guy has uh three five thousand nine hundred fifty five, and storm guy has four thousand two hundred and eighty five. I will be back in just a second. Right, I am back. We are just killing now. Um, hopefully, yeah, definitely killing. Uh, lovely. Ice guy was a little bit tough there, a little bit tough. Um, next door, next door. What is in here? Destroy. Destroy. Looks like Morg's been busy building a better minion. Let's put a few dents in these tin cans. Okie dokie, Buster Bots. We did need our death prisms after all. Who would have thought? Um, but yeah, we'll do this fight on camera because we haven't actually seen these guys before. Um, rank 19 elite death, obviously. And they have 5,120 health, which is a little bit. A little bit. I'm expecting a lot and lot a lot of weaknesses. Uh, because that seems to be all that these guys do. Um, fortify and weakness. Or brace and weakness. That's what I'm expecting. Especially if it's to go after the last de death guys that we defeated. Oh, Rockalops. Okay. Yep. Fa sounds good. I think... I can't remember if this is Rock... Punk... I think it's Punkopolops. Or whatever you call it. I don't know. I don't know these spells' names. I just see Rock Cyclops, Rockalops. All the same to me. All the same, except I know what schools they do, kind of, based on the look of them. Um, I would like some prisms. Not prisms. I would like some blades, sir. That would be really handy and cool and good. Weakness. Plague. Oh, a hit. Okay. Wow, they're being spicy today. They're actually hitting me. Who would have thought? Who would have thought? Crazy stuff. Crazy, crazy, crazy. I love how he's got statues in the background of himself. What a, what a nerd. Imagine having statues of yourself in your own house. Like, that's kind of crazy. That's some super duper evil stuff right there. Okay, Blades. Lovely. Dark Pact. Love to see it. Love to see it. Um, I don't really want this blade, but we're going to use it. We're going to use it. I think we can kill next. I think. We do have a boost. Um, as long as I don't brace, we should be fine. Okay, a dark pack. Okay, you're just dark packing each other. That's so cute. Honestly, really cute. Love it. Love to see it. Love to see it. Love to see it. Uh, this is a poison. Oh no, just a want it. Fair enough. Fair enough. Eight five eight three one. I can't read. Very cool. Slightly damaging. Slightly damaging. We do have another blade. Do I do another blade or do I pretend we can kill? I pretend we can kill. They've already taken some of their health off. We can surely kill. As long as we hit 5,000, it's fine. And I think we can do that with a boost and a crit. And us being great, I think we can do it. I believe in ourselves. 
3,000. Okay, we didn't kill at least one of them. The other one might have died, possibly. Yeah, one of them died. The other one isn't, but that's fine. We can not ship a force. We'll have to blade into a blade into a grim reader. That'll be fine. That'll be fine. He conserved the pip. What? What the heck? Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. This is illegal. This is illegal in this state. We don't accept this here. S M H, my head. S M H, destroy me, please. That did a lot okay i wasn't actually meaning for you to actually destroy me it was more of a metaphorical thing for you to consider not for you to actually do but that's fine uh hopefully this kills one blade 45 with the grim reader should kill should theoretically kill it may not but it should um right crit blade and faint nice and this will definitely kill he is dead dead big dead Bye. Morg's quaking in his shoes now, wizard. Let's go! He's quaking in his cowboy boots. That's such a shame. Right. Hi, Morgs. Hello. Ah, wizard. You are here at last. I have made the most startling discovery. There are worlds beyond Lemuria. I owe you so much, wizard. If I hadn't met you, I never would have discovered the spiral, is it? Now, I have dozens of new worlds to conquer. I shall be emperor of the universe, and everyone shall live in mutual peace, harmony, and contentment under my rule. Forget it, Morg. You're going down. Right. Let's do this. Um, I've set up my deck a little bit, um, and I'll explain the cheats in just a moment. But a moment, my friends. Uh, we're going to brace right off the bat. Um, so, you can't be late, otherwise he will cast a shadow spell to summon another random minion, even though he's already got some random minions, which is fine. Um, at the beginning of the first round, he will cheat cast Guardian Spirit on a random enemy minion. And at the end of every round, he will cheat cast a Tower Shield on a random enemy minion, favoring minions with the least amount of shields. Um, if you beguile a minion before cheat casting... Um, he will cast it on the wizard instead, if he has no other minions. Um, and at the beginning of every third round and every three rounds after, a random enemy minion will cast a shadow power nova that deals 500 shadow damage and steals one pip from each target and grants enemy combat one pip. So, that's fun. Um... And if damage over time effect is placed on a wizard, a random enemy will cheat cast a shadow version of detonate that affects all enemies. Um, this cheat does not trigger if the target was previously beguiled in the same round. There's so many things about beguile in this, and I just get so confused. Beguile is confusing. <laughs> beguile is confusing. Um, and uh when all of the enemy minions are defeated morg will cheat cast a shadow vision of regenerate on himself that removes 99 percent of his total health and he will have 120 health remaining so yeah that's pretty cool that's pretty cool hopefully we managed to do this pretty successfully it shouldn't be too difficult it was really challenging on my fire he does resist fire quite significantly from memory as well so that's slightly worrying um, I do have some death spares for this very reason of trying to not only pierce through shields, but also, uh, death resist on this guy. And he's got a shield, of course, because that makes so much sense. Uh, we're going to do this. Convert blade to 50% blade. Don't know what that means, but we're going to see. Because we haven't used this on camera yet, so might as well. I don't think I've actually used this to start with at all. Um, so we'll see. We will see what it does. Zero pips. Might as well use it. Won't use our blade, hopefully. And if it does, it'll just make it better blade, I guess. I think that's how it works. I don't know. Um, gain one pip. Okay. So many pip taking. Unfortunate. Um, right. Let's see how this goes. We're doing on the death guy, mainly because one, he's got a shield. And two, because we hate death guys because they resist me. Crit. Hello. Lovely. Minus shield. Love to see it. Buck does his thing. And then we get a... A blade into a 50 blade. Ooh, hello. That's kind of nice. That's a big boy blade. Big boy blade. We like it. I will definitely hit next. 
basically, is what it's saying. What it's saying is hit next. Actually, I'll probably spear and then hit. Because, you know, I'll actually use spear spells. Might as well. <laughs> Might as well. Might as well use them. I have death spear. Might as well use it sometime. Um, crit. Okay, this is going to hurt a little bit. Yeah, and give him basically all of the health that I did on him back, which is great. That's fine. You know, I was just getting the spirit shield off, obviously. Oh, not the spirit. The shield, the... the what's it called? Thingy-mabob, do hicka what's it? The tower shield, that's it. I can speak. I England stuff words thing. <clears throat> this spirit armor is slightly annoying, but it doesn't really affect me, which is good. Very good. Lovely. Do it. Destroy. Destroy yourself, please. Get destroyed. Get destroyed. Just kidding. Just kidding. These guys have a lot of pips. Holy moly. Holy moly's. Holy me oh my, that's gonna hurt. Yep, just a little bit. And this is probably gonna hurt. We need to hit ASAP. We might actually have to hit next round because this guy has like insane outgoing damage. He has 146. And his spells are kind of OP. This is gonna detonate me as well. Oh no, I'm gonna be on like zero health. Yep, okay. Because this does a overtime. So yeah, that's not cool. That ain't cool or good. That ain't cool or good. Um, yep, here's the detonate. Here's the detonate. Okay, that didn't do as much as I thought it would. Didn't do as much as I thought it would, which is good. Very good. Um, we, I kind of feel like just hitting. Here's so many pips. And I'm kind of afraid of a s'mores right now. Because he knows s'more. Blast off is fine. Um, fire from above, scorching is all like pain. So I feel like just hitting right now is probably a best bet. Um, I feel like it's probably a good idea. At least he's shielding the life guys at the moment, which is great. Probably not going to kill the death guy, but that's fine. I have um, counted for extra hits that I may need to do, which is cool. Um, okay. Kablam. Yeah, did not even get close to killing any of them. Which is a little bit of a shame. Did need some more damage there, which is fine. Um, but we will blade into another hit very soon. I didn't crit, I don't think. Which is slightly bad. Slightly bad. This is where I start to not crit all the time. Because these guys have too much block. Kind of sad. Kind of sad. Very unfortunate. Infernal Salamander. Cool. And this is why I hit. <laughs> Oh, another detonate. This is going to do a lot of damage because it's, what, like, 750 around, so... Oh, plus 750, so, yeah, like, 1,000. I think it's, like, a pretty high spell amended Infernal Salamander. I'm pretty sure because I don't think that it's the base number. Um, We're going to redo our brace. The brace is, like, actually really decent for this fight. Um, So we re-up brace. Re-up brace. We're going to blade a couple times. Probably also do a spear and then hit, I think, is the best bet. Oh my gosh. Why you faint me? Why you do this? More gas, too many perps. Oh my. Oh me, oh my. This is slightly scary. Can they stop doing this? Seriously? Seriously, can they stop? Can they stop? This is probably one of the hardest, I would say, fights. In, in like the whole Lemuria sort of thing before you get to like the final fights because it, they're kind of difficult but like this one's probably up there for difficulty most of the other ones are kind of easy but these cheats are like kind of big kind of big cheats kind of big cheats and I did die when we did this um on my fire we died the first time we tried this it probably didn't help that he was fire so you know that's kind of kind of bad we need to desperately hit again which is great. We're going to fizzle, though. Um, we're going to do 45. 45. The star burns for Morg. Okay, cute. That's cute. That's cute. That's cute, okay, but just chill. Chill. Chill, please. It's going to do nothing. But still, annoying. Slightly annoying. Slightly annoying. Um, don't fizzle. Please don't fizzle. Please don't fizzle. We didn't fizzle, which is great. 
That would have been really awkward if we fizzled. I have to probably hit next round. We're beguiled. That's fine. We don't have to hit next round. That's okay. We can spear or blade. Either one. Probably spear, I would say. Probably a spear I'll do. Um, That's fine. Because I can't hit them next round. They can't hit me. Actually, no. They can probably hit me, but I can't hit them. Because that makes sense. That makes sense. But I can see what they're doing. So that's cool. Actually, no. Surely they can't hit me next round. That would be a little bit OP. That'd be a little bit OP, I think. But what would be really cool is the fact that we might get a shield. Because we don't have any shields, so they might be like, hey, you need shield. We give you shield now. That would be really nice of him. That would be really considerate of him. What is they doing? Blade, blade, dark pact. Imagine if that's on me. Imagine if that's on me. Um, We're going to... That's a 45. We're going to do this. Morg will protect you. It's not me. What? What do you mean? What do you mean Morg will protect you? He wants to protect me, obviously. Obviously, he wants to protect me. It's on himself. Why would he do that to himself? Man's just nearly destroyed himself. All for a, all for a blade. Wow. Okay, buddy. Okay, buddy. Good job. At least I know they're not hitting me this round. And it means I can hit with the Scarecrow next in a little bit of pace. A little bit of pace. Um, yeah, Scarecrow. Sounds good. We then re-up our brace. Sounds like a plan. Sounds like a plan. That man's just has all of the shields. He's just like, you know what? I know the cheat says that it will pri prioritize people who don't have shields. But actually, we're going to prioritize people who do have shields this time. Just for fun. Just for fun. A little bit quirky which is slightly funny but hey whatever whatever okay we're back to full health which is great i think one of the minions is dead two of them three of them three of them are dead one will come back to life in a sec um morgs is about to die this is a small machine just as well i hit holy moly i was considering blading again but i'm like no a really not a good idea we were dying not a good idea to blade not a good idea at all blam that did massive damage massive big boy damage there holy moly holy moly he's back to life luckily it's the life guy 813 that's okay we can just ship a fools eh easy clap ship a fools 813 yeah easy we might even be able to kill morgs honestly might even be able to kill morg the merciless possibly not but we'll see We'll see. Take my pip. How dare you. How dare you take my pip, sir. Don't worry. I do have a plan to kill him once he's done. That'll cost zero pips. Oh, he got a shield. Yeah, that's a little bit annoying. That's a little bit annoying. I completely forgot about that bit. But that's fine. Whatever. It's okay. It's okay. You know, shield... Pff, who, who needs them, you know? I can kill with shield, obviously. It's only 34%. Yeah, easy clap. I actually think we might have killed Morg as well. Did we? Oh, no, we didn't. He's about to die. He's about to die. This is our plan to kill him. I'm going to just pass one round. I didn't know if he did it this round or the round after. So, yeah. This is a regenerate that will destroy him. Absolutely destroyed. Get wrecked, kiddo. Um, yep. Get wrecked. Get absolutely kefluddled. Imagine if he had immolate and just destroyed himself. That would be so funny. That would actually be hilarious. 120 health. Simple wee little wand hit here. Will save the day. Kablam. He's dead. GG. Easy clap! I wasn't even worried. I was slightly worried. Curse you, Gordon. Before you gloat, know this. You've won nothing. I've just triggered a failsafe that will drop Sky City. <laughs> Quick, stabilize the ascension beam or we're all dead. I don't mind dying. <laughs> um, right, ascension beam, here we go. Well done, wizard. Nothing left now but the celebrating. <laughs> Let's head back. 
Right, lovely. We did it. We did it. We saved Sky City. Very cool. Let's take out one of these. And a couple of these, and one of those, and one of those, and one of those, and all of the spears we actually used. Wow. First time I think I've ever actually used spears in a Death Walkthrough episode. Very cool. Finally using some spells that I don't normally use. You guys must be so proud of me. So proud of me. Expanding my strategies. Wow. Crazy. Just you wait for next, next time. Just you wait, man. Just you wait. We're going to be expanding our strategies significantly when we finish this death walkthrough and go into the next world. It's going to be insane. <laughs> Absolutely insane. Um, right. Let's head back here. Do I have a... I actually have a mark here. So just to save us a little bit of time, we'll mark! just go there. Ah! You saved every one of us! Put credit where it's due. The human carried the day. Thank you, wizard. By the way, look who I found. Doc, hello. Took you long enough. I seem to have arrived a little late. I'm sorry I was delayed. My new auto gyro took three iterations before it could take off. Coconuts are harder to work with than I anticipated. Don't fret, Doc. I had the wizard with me. It'll take a little time for the mind ray to wear off, but Sky City is free again. Wizard, you need to take something you got from the old one's monitoring station to Telos, right? I'll be happy to fly you. <laughs> I'll come along. There are some people in Telos I'd like to introduce you to, Buck. Doc, you're leaving again? So soon? You just got here. Don't worry, my dear. I won't be fighting barbarian manders this time. I'll be back before you know it. To the landing platform! Right! Here we go. We are finishing off Sky City. Such a short wee area, considering the other ones. They take a little bit longer, but this one, just two episodes. Easy clap. Easy peasy. In and out. Pretty quick. Um, but yeah, if you didn't remember, we did get our wee little stone that we needed last episode right at the start. And literally, the first thing we did when we got here was get the stone. Um, everything else was kind of like a side quest sort of thing, but that's fine. That's fine, you know. Filler stuff. We love it. We love it. Anyway, order Illustrious gyro. wizard, I would speak to you before you leave us, if I may. I don't know if I want to speak to you, Zoggy Moggy. Wizard, we must beg your pardon. We have treated you very badly. We feared you as an outsider, as one who did not conform to the ways of the community. The Mind Ray turned our fear into hate. But you saved us. You showed us that even though they stand alone, an individual can do amazing things. I see. Cooperation is important, but if one submits entirely to the group, one loses agency. Worse, the community can be co-opted to dire ends, like mana theft. The character of a community is built on the individual characters within it. We must be true to ourselves to keep the world honest. You saved us, wizard, even though you did not need to. You shall forever have our thanks. Well said. Now let's go, wizard. Right, let's head back to Telos. Lovely. That's a job well done here in Sky City. Fantastic. And here we go back to Duck Savage, who is just over here. Hello. Hi. I didn't think I'd be back so soon. Now we have things to do. Impressive, isn't it? Buck. There's someone I want you to meet. Wizard, I believe you have a harmonic gate to unlock. Right. Stone number... I don't know. I can't remember. Storm one, though. Kablam. Only one attunement stone left. Then at last we will find the world synthesizer. Shall we check in once more with Quartermain? Probably a good idea. Let's let's check in with Quartermain, who is up here. Ha ha. Bum ba dum bum ba da bum ba da la la dum. Right, Quartermain, how how is you? Welcome back. This is Heroes Guild. Starting to look really cool. We got some flags up now. Wow. The wizard. Ha <laughs> ha. Five stones found. Sadly, that is all your map points to. Five, not six. Verily. While many regions are indicated, none seem to hold a monitoring station. 
as you call them? Perhaps the old judge never finished. Or the task is meant to get more difficult. There is one place we can look. A place of darkness. Sky City drifted over several times. Egad, the heap, of course. I've been to that wretched hive. It is where lost things go, which makes it a logical place to find something. The heap is through the wildlands, beyond Ursai village. Be careful, wizard. Lost things are also desperate things. Right. And that is it. Next time we start probably the best area of Lemuria, in my opinion, and probably a lot of other people's opinion, Heap. So yeah, next time we'll be heading into Heap. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Smash like, subscribe, and as always, remember to craft outside the box. Yeah.